this is Dr. Bev Knox and you are viewing my psychology tutorials. Learn psychology while you sleep. A categorical variable consists of a set of non-overlapping categories. The measurement scale of a categorical variable is ordinal if the categories exhibit a natural ordering, such as opinion variables with categories from strongly disagree to strongly agree. The measurement scale is nominal if there is no inherent ordering. The types of possible analysis for categorical data depends on the measurement scale. Again, categorical data is data that is collected in groups or topics. The number of events in each group is counted numerically. For example, if I wanted to understand the different types of reading interests in my office, then I would collect categorical data to identify the genre of books that each of my coworkers like. I can organize that data into a table. Each part of this table will show the categorical data that was collected and can be used in research. Now let us talk about the difference between categorical and quantitative data. Sometimes it can be difficult to understand the differences between categorical and quantitative data. Remember, Categorical data, as the name implies, is grouped into some sort of category or multiple categories. Quantitative data is related to quantities, things like height, weight, GPA, number of hours spent studying, and other types of information that are quantitative and are collected just as numbers. A good way to remember the difference between categorical and quantitative data is to examine the answer to this question. If the answer is a number, then the data is quantitative. If the answer is a preference or characteristic or any other thing than a number, then the data is categorical. For example, if you ask someone, how tall are you? They would answer with a number, five foot, 10 inches. If someone asks, what's your favorite sport? Then they should answer with a preference, such as baseball or tennis. Therefore, the first question gives us quantitative data and the second gives us categorical data.